we are on the heels of XXW Battle at the Beach. But before we do, we have to make a stop at XXW Fallout. What's good, family? Double J James Jenkins from across the bridge. Letting you know what's really good. Come on in, sit on down as we kick this first match off with Johnny Styles heading to the ring. Later tonight, XIW CEO Bishop makes an announcement pertaining to Battle at the Beach. But we'll get to that later. As always, like, subscribe, follow, all that deal. Got a great show for you tonight. Action pack. Y'all know what's good. We got Johnny Styles in this piece. Ready to go to war. Vibe it out. And if you know that sound, you know what it is. He is your XXW Tag Team Champion. The Strategic Cup winner. Arm Armageddon Team Tap Out represented. I'm talking about Josh Armstrong. Number one contender to the XXW Heritage Champion. The stars seem to be aligning for Mr. Armstrong. As he get a little dusty tonight with uh, Johnny Styles. Got that strategic case ready. The only man to ever win the XXW strategic case. Back to back winner. When I tell you the luck of the draw, who would have thunk it? All right, let's get active. Ding dong. Johnny Styles hot out the gate, spamming the button. Perfect. Nice little toss over suplex style. Looking to get Armstrong out of here early in the game. Got the two count. Uh. Getting it to him. Johnny Styles hit it up. Y'all know what this means. Calling his shot. Looking to get it. Oh. GPS a little off. Miss. Backstabber. Working out. Nice little shot to the top of the head. Josh Armstrong not too happy. Clearly not feeling the disrespect. Uh-oh. Ah. Off the road. Oh, catching him. And now it's Josh Armstrong spamming the button. Uh-oh. Oh. Look. Oh. Josh Armstrong giving it all to him. Count it down. Only get the one. Johnny Styles seem to be in there. Armstrong hit it back up to the top rope. Savage elbow. Macho man is. 
Uh oh, oh no, went to clear him out. Didn't see that coming. Caught him with the Pele. Back of the head. Honey Style setting him up, bringing him out. Going in for the pin. Oh. The champ out at two. Johnny Styles back up to that top rope one more again. Hopefully this time he get it. No. Too slow. Got caught lacking. Oh. Just balled him up with the pin. And your winner. Josh Armstrong. This content brought to you by MRL365. You can check us out by downloading the app, following our social media, or going to MRL365.com. As we get into this next match, headed to the ring. You see him, Demon M, the wild man of XXW, looking to get some J, I don't know what that is, that's Justice. Former XXW Fallout Champion, former XXW Champion, looking to regain some some status in this game. But he looks to have his hands full as the Super Cruiserweight heads down to the ring. The massive behemoth. And talk about a round and pound clash of styles. I said it once, I'm going to say it again. Behemoth always quick out the gate but can't close. Can he close it up tonight? Or should we expect what we always seems to get? I will say this, Behemoth has been doing better. This is XXW, competition is high. So it's no shot on him. But with competition at a high level, you have to be able to bring it. And Demon M ain't no easy win. As you can see, spamming the button off the rope. Caught him with the forearm. Count it. Behemoth out at one. A little bit of flossing by Demon M. Uh. Behemoth thought he was going to catch him lacking. Even flow. Demon them say, uh uh, none of that. Dropping them fifth ward knees on them. Oh, Beam made it like lunch money, spamming the button. Oh, missed them. Taking them shots. Uh, another even flow. Yeah, giving us a little. Little raven look. 
And Dean and them stand on them, dropping the bowls to him. Whoa! Out of here, count it down. Oh, Behemoth still in it. Now, normally, Behemoth is the one that come out the gate flying as a lady looks to be taking, taking more, I'm taking more licks. Kick out at one. This is the second match that I done seen. A behemoth come out with a slow start. And now he's in full control. Doing old boy dirty. Wrenching back on that arm. Reaching back on them fingers. Quick knees to the back. Bam! Laid it into him. Demon them ate it. Looking to get him out of here. Spamming the button on him. Up and on him. Bam! 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 And the brakes off of Behemoth. Behemoth managed to get it as the frustration set in on Demon M. Uh oh. Count him. Wow. Caught him with it. Count it down. Behemoth looking to close this thing out. The super heavyweight is headed up to the super cruiserweight up. Super cruiserweight down. Springboard. Ever seen a man move like that? And it's out of here. Your winner, Behemoth. Looky, looky, who do we have here? Number one contender for the XXW Extreme Championship. I'm talking about Bloody Skulls. And as he looks forward to this match against Jaden Walker. Definitely ready to put in work tonight. Like Bloody Skulls got his hands full. Former XXW champion, the Total Task Thomas. In a bit of a foul mood as of late. Mm -hmm. 
Heading down to the ring. Again, the song. Bloody skulls drawn first blood. Well known task. Dunking him on his head. Looking to eliminate that power game. Can't hold me, you can't lift me. Taz say, uh uh. It's my turn. Dead lifting them up, tossing them around. Showing off the muscles. We got a little 757 action headed to the top rope. Calling his shot. Double axe handle, top rope. Look, all we got is a sleeping bloody skull. It's kind of down. As he kick out at the one. And the total task, Thomas, back on him. Bam! Caught him with one. Bloody skulls. Oh! Spoke too soon. Oh, we got a little back and forth action. Let's go setting them up to get them out of here. Count it. Taz on the one. Oh. Turnabout is fair play. Dropping them on his face. Count it. Bloody Skulls kick out at the one. Setting them up. Got him. Got him wrecked. Oh. Taking out that spine. Got him wrecked again. Oh. He just bited him. Count it down. Bloody skull still in it. As the crowd goes dumb, Taz drops down a knuckle sandwich. But he's ready to take it to the next level. Oh, Bloody Skulls cutting him off at the pass. Look at Oh, bodied him. Catching him with another one. Count it. Total task. Thomas kicks out again. Oh, caught him. Massive head, but putting the boots to him. Look like he's rolling. Count him. And your winner in unimaginable fashion, the total task, Thomas.
Over the last few weeks, CEO Bishop has been inundated with questions pertaining to the XXW Championship and the Fallout Championship going into battle at the beach. On his Chestnut Chuckers podcast, the CEO finally addressed what will happen going forward. You see what I'm saying? So the prestige of the titles is what's important. It's about maintaining that value and keeping it at a high level so that when you step in this business you know the these titles mean something more than any other brand more than any other company that's within this landscape so when it comes to the xxw championship and also the fallout champion chip you know we have to make sure that everything is done in a way that keeps it at that high level so this is what i'm looking at first thing first am heat has been a stellar champion he has been a great fallout champion he won it from a person who was a stellar fallout champion and everyone that has maintained that fallout championship has been a one stellar champions that is not to be denied that is not to be disputed that is the case That has been the fallout championship. You see what I'm saying? So I have to think about that when going forward and how we shall address it. Now, we already know that JT Money is the number one contender for the XXW fallout championship. That is set in stone. That match will happen at Battle at the Beach. But we have to figure out how we're going to get there before we can even give him that opportunity so as of this moment and i don't want to say that that am he is being stripped of the xxw fallout championship i will say that he is vacating the xxw fallout championship now as a reward or or a prize of such he will have a standing opportunity uh to regain that championship and and that's only because he managed to do what few have been able to do and that's uh win the xxw championship while being the xxw fallout championship uh champion excuse me and being able to maintain that and carry it to that high level so for that i will give him that opportunity that should he lose the xxw championship the no rematch clause applies to the xxw championship because that rule will not change but for him i will give him an opportunity to rematch for the xxw fallout championship but first we got to figure out who will be facing jt money at battle at the beach so i came up with this we're going to have a xxw fallout championship match it's going to be an ultimate extreme match simple as that we're going to put that fallout championship up in the sky hang it from the rafters and we're going to have a fatal four-way match and whoever wins that match will face off later in the evening against jt money and that and whoever wins that match by the end of the night they will be either the retaining fallout champion or we'll have two new fallout champions champions in one night so that's the case on that and those four men who have put in the work who deserve an opportunity who deserve a shot at the xxw fallout championship goes a little something like this tyler ace the total task thomas demon m and the broken down errorless johnny styles those four men will face off in the xxw fallout championship ultimate extreme match 
Whoever wins that will become the new XXW Fallout Championship uh, champion, excuse me, and they will go on to face JT Money, and the winner of that match will be your XXW Fallout champion going forward. Simple as that, and that's to make sure that the value stays. So to get that title, you have to go through hell and high water, and then turn around and defend it the same night. And pull and pull that off and put your name in at your name in stone as the XXW Fallout Champion. Just as simple as that. Now, as we get to the XXW Championship. Now, we have three men. All three men have a value claim. AM Heat is already the XXW champion. Prize fighter feels as though he was wronged. And although the fallout, not the fallout, the um, no rematch clause should apply. AM Heat granted him the opportunity to come at the title to come for the crown again. Now I don't want to mess up a good thing. So yeah. We're gonna give you that shot. So the first match of the night. Well, probably not the first, but we definitely we have a Two XXW championship matches as well. First thing first, we will have AM Heat, the champion, taking taking on the man above all, the prize fighter. And the winner of that match will go on into the main event to face Wild Rage. And the winner of that match will be either your retaining or new XXW champion. And this is all to make sure that the value stays there. Battle at the beach will be epic. And we will see if there are any paper champions in XXW. And as we get into this main event, the CEO Bishop has laid down the law. Wild Rage heading to the ring, making it final. The match is set. Matches are set. As we get the Ultimate Extreme Match Fatal 4 Way for the XXW Fallout Championship And we get the main event Wild Rage versus the winner Either the Prize Fighter Or AM Heat For the XXW Championship Tonight we get what could possibly be a preview of the main event as we got the current XXW championship champion AM Heat heading down to the ring to take on a game wild rage AM Heat came into the game and literally shook XXW at its foundation. Team tap out, continues to run rough shot over XXW, not holding on to the main title, but yet and still. Longest reigning XXW Extreme Champion Jaden Walker. 
got the strategic cup winner and tag team champion Josh Armstrong as we get into this match prize fighter taking the XXW fallout champion former XXW champion but AM Heat has came in and literally shook things up while Rage managed to keep getting caught in the crossfire every chance he get at the XXW championship he always seemed to get crossed out by somebody as you can see the frustration setting in he is ready to do damage as he beat the brakes off of the XXW champion AM Heat just dumping on him I don't even think he cares he wins tonight. He just went to beat the hell out of him. Four. Oh, stole off on him. I'm spamming the button. Dropping the elbow. Uh-oh. Damn heat. Matching his energy. Got him up. Tossing the big man up. Headed up to the top row. We could fly. Big body splash. Counted down. Oh, too close to the ropes. Doesn't matter. Continue to beat down. Lost into the crowd. Dropping more boots to him. Wild Rage looking to get space. Spamming the button. Back outside. I'm. 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 Bam, 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 bam. I need out of here. And continue to beat the beast down. Wild Rage is not for the play play tonight. Just wailing on him. I do not think he cares much. Just want to soften the champ up. Strengthen his eyes at XXW Battle at the Beach. I'm just decimating him. Wailing on him. Oh! AM Heat is in his in a bad spot right now while Rage in his bag. A little pose off. Seven. And he quit. Clean him up. Dropping him. Got him. Yoked him. Counted down. And your winner. XXW champion AM Heat. And that is it, folks. Make sure you tune in to MRL 365 TV for XXW Ground Zero, Double J James Jenkins, Cross the Bridge. You know what it is. Love.